Hey everybody, uh, I want to welcome you to Building with Pallets, which is brought to you by the Pallet Hacienda. Uh, a lot of you guys follow us on Facebook at the Pallet Hacienda and been asking for some how-to videos on how we actually do things around here. So I figured we'd start this off with making a 55 gallon shop vac. Uh, when you do a lot of your own work, you need something bigger than, than a normal shop vac. And I priced these out. The cheapest one I could find was over $600. I mean, I'm like, really? And then there was a conversion kit on Amazon that was still $400. I'm like, now wait a minute here. We can make this pretty simple. So, here's what you need. A shot back, obviously. You're gonna need a 55 gallon barrel. You're gonna need some silicone. You're gonna need a six inch hole saw. And then you're gonna need a hole saw that fits the adapter that comes out of here. So, shouldn't take you too long. Let's get started. Okay, the good thing about this, these are pretty much a standard size six inch holes. So any brand generally works. Look at that. Now, to hold it on there, take one of your filters, push it up through there, and those fit a little bit of work, and voila. There we have a nice head ready to go for a 55 gallon shot. Now you can silicone this in place, you can put a strap on it, you can do whatever you want. But they generally, they generally stay in place without too much of an issue. Now, what do we got here? This comes out. If you can put this back together, how to shoot you. Three inch hole saw. And these are generally the same also. And really you want to keep it towards the top, but anywhere is gonna be fine. Okay guys, there you have it. You pretty much have a 55 gallon shop back. Let that dry. It is silicone, so it will just take a couple hours. Put your lid back on here like this. Liked what you've seen, even though it won't win any beauty contest, it is fully functional. Please subscribe to the new YouTube channel or come see us on Facebook at the Pallet Hacienda. Thank you, and guys, have a good day. We'll see you next week.